Derek Ray. I'm joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a spectacular final. It's Real Madrid, and they take on Osasuna. Well, it's been a long journey for both these teams, Derek. It's not been easy, but these players are 90 minutes away from making history for themselves. No doubt both managers will have set out their game plans and made sure every player knows exactly what their roles are. What a game we have in store for us. And now they get the ball rolling. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. David Alaba plays with Antonio Rudiga in central defence. Federico Valverde plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And operating through the middle in attack today, Karim Benzema. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Vinicius Jr. He might be able to carve something out. And the problem not completely solved. Tony Kroos. Andrej. Here's Kroos. And return to Modric. Could be. Oh, it's in! Real Madrid make the opening statement in the final. And it could be massively important. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. Restarted 1 0 here. We saw the situation developing into the advanced position. Ruben Garcia and on to Gomez. There to win it back. Karim Benzema. Benzema. Vinicius Jr. And it's still on. Terrific block. And a super header. It looked as though it might be going in. Well, Real pushing to add to the lead. It's a corner. And over it comes, and clears his lines. Is this the moment? And still danger here. And in the end, no damage done. Unai Garcia. Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile. Real Madrid have certainly had all the possession over the last 15 minutes and with it have created some great openings. They certainly look as though they get another before too long. Yes, it's going to plan and they might be able to carve out another chance. Nicely timed tackle. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. And caught by the keeper. 
and to Budimir. And very deftly cut out. And moving through the gears now, Benzema. And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here's the replay, and it has been coming. They've played some great football in this game, and they fully deserve this goal. again at 2-0 Ezekiel Avila read it superbly to take back possession oh he's through here in it goes he's made it a brace for himself no stopping him apparently Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. So on they go again, and every indication that Real are going to stroll to victory here. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. Chouameni. Modric. This looks threatening. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. So it is, the first half has come to an end here in the Spanish capital. Well, underway once more. And it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Benzema. This is Kroos. Benzema. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw in to come. Unai Garcia, Ruben Garcia, David Garcia, and a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Moncayola. Here's Ruben Garcia. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? They've lost it. Well, as you can see, Real Madrid have controlled the possession and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. Will he find the net? Well, what a stop that was. Well, he's gone back and shown him a yellow card, Stuart. Well, that was a poor challenge. The referee wasn't going to forget that, was he? Trying to deliver it accurately. 
Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Tony Kroos. Karim Benzema. Benzema's pass, not accurate enough. And strong play here. Valverde. Course. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Ezekiel Avila. And he keeps going. Superb block. That is how to apply the pressure. Tony Kroos. Well, keeping hold of the ball is what it's all about for them. Just 15 minutes remaining. Oh, breezing past him. Superbly read and executed. This might be ideal for the counter. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Well, it looks like open road for them, but up a dead end. Modric. Progress has been made by Luka Modric. And Benzema wasteful with that one. We're inside the final five minutes. My goodness, this has not been close at all. A really top-notch piece of defending. He has teammates around him. And he read it well, intercepting it. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Vinicius Jr. Benzema. Well, he successfully got past him. Vinicius Jr. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. There's a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition. And so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken.
Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.